Hello, my name is Ramo Ayivo and I'm here at the National Secretariat of the Ghana Registered Nurses and Midwives Association. Today we are having the maiden conference uh, for the Nurse Midwives uh, Specialist Society of Ghana, NMSSG, and then uh, I had the privilege of meeting uh, some of the specialists uh, in the society to talk briefly to them and then uh, they also share with me their expectations for this conference. And so, sister, please uh, may we know you and then your specialty area. I'm Cynthia Mati, Neonatal Intensive Care Nursing. Neonatal Intensive Care Nursing um, is her specialty area and so you are welcome to the conference. Thank you very much. All right, so what are your expectations for this conference? Uh, it's been the first ever, and it's expected to be twice every year. So this is the first time you are having this conference. So share with us your expectations. Yes, for this conference, we are expecting all our specialist nurses and midwives to come around for us to see and discuss our challenges that we are facing. As the newly, or let's say, we have been in the system for some time, not, not too long. Yeah, so we are facing challenges and we are wishing that it will be addressed today. And then we are, we are hoping to meet our leaders who, are, who will chair and direct affairs to also take along, find ways and means of helping us to inculcate us into the system so that it will improve on quality care. In fact, our, top, our theme is to invest in specialist nurses. It is very difficult and it's becoming a problem when you are you are being trained or you are, you are improving as a professional nurse. Becoming a specialist is costly and it seems like we are investing more into it and we wish that our leaders will take it up so that they will invest in us by sponsoring us so that we'll be able to have more of the specialist nurses and midwives. Thank you so much. You have said a lot and then uh, picking from what you said, it means that uh, the specialist training is very costly and then the expectation is that government invests and then sponsors nurses and midwives into pursuing the specialist courses. Uh, what are some of the other challenges you face, especially during the training as a specialist? Training. Yes, during training you see that we are coming from all over the country. Some are coming from the northern region, Volta region, Eastern and other places. And most of the times we have our, our centers to be in Accra, Kumase and now in Tamale. But somebody can come from uh, Tamale to Accra. Having an accommodation to come to the school is not easy because the school doesn't have an accommodation. Yes, so we have to be going around looking for a place to, a lo to lodge. And let's say you'll be working, you'll be stationed at Ridge or 37. And you have to be coming from Kaswa all the way to be coming for clinicals every day. You go for lectures, yes. So it's accommodation too is one of the greatest challenges for uh, residents and for we who are coming up to become nurse specialists. So that one too will be addressed for us. Interesting. And so uh, accommodation is another big challenge that the, uh, the specialists face during the course of their uh, training. Uh, so today we are expecting the leaders and then the stakeholders who will be around to tell us the way forward to also address as the theme of the conference tells us. So uh, thank you so much, thank you so for, much for speaking to us. Uh, I know there are nurses and midwives out there who also want to pursue the specialist uh, uh, training and become specialists in the future, especially uh, on your side. What is your your, what are your words to these people who have the interest of pursuing a specialist training? Wow, thank you very much. This is a great opportunity that I'm calling all the nurses and midwives, especially those who work at the neonatal intensive care units, at the um, labor ward, the line in ward, that it's, it's a great opportunity for us to know we are working. But sometimes the physiologists behind what we do, and then there are some, some kind of assessments we are supposed to do to find out and identify problems in babies so that we can challenge and help them to pre give them a quality life. But um, if you are not specialized, we are all doing it in general, yes. But from the training, I, I realize that if I'm working, I, I have the, the, the capacity and the confidence that if this baby gets into my hands, this baby is assured of quality life because I have an assessment to do, I know what to look out for in the babies, the abnormalities that I have to look out for, and then 
the kind of teamwork those that have to refer babies to so that they will be able to be well catered for and so i'm encouraging all our nurses and midwives out there please get on board though it's expensive but you know and um, health is expensive as well and then um uh -huh. so whoever wants to get something good doing must invest in it so start investing saving some monies so that you can also come and enroll into the next specialist program you come out and you love it thank you it is expensive but it's worth it and so those are the words of our sister but then uh, we finally want you to uh, use this opportunity to greet your best friends at work mention their names and then send a shout out to them all Right, shout out to um, Eastern Regional Hospital. Yes, they, they really supported me when I came to school. Shout out to my pastor, Pastor Benoy. He, she, he is the one and the family who really accommodated me throughout my school in Accra. Yes, and he is now at the Pentecost Convention Center. I say shout out to him. My husband, Mr. Samuel Lotu, and my kids. I say shout out to all of them because they have been a great support to me. And to all neonatal intensive care uh, nurses at the Eastern Regional Hospital and Kangaroo Mother Care Clinic, I say shout out to you all. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Please. And so um, that is uh, sister. That was Sister Mate uh, talking to us. Sister Cynthia Mate talking to us. Thank you for coming. I wish you all the best. Good.